All right, good. So we've cloned. Now we want to group. The whole point of grouping is so that instead of having, what's this, two, four, six, seven individual items, I want to group it into one image. I select all the images I want to group. I go to format, same place I find locking, I select grouping and then group. I know the all images are like one image that you're moving around. What you could have is all those various protein items in one as a grouping, all the stuff for fruits, all the stuff for vegetables and then at the bottom you could have each category and have the student come up to board and say, okay, these are different food groups. Match which one it, that goes for each one.